Hello, beloved brethren. What a show the Lord gave us yesterday, huh? Wow. Uh, apparently, other brothers and sisters noticed it, and that's awesome. Um, so, two things in this scripture. First, uh, you can see in Romans right here. Uh, let's see, it's 9.33 or 32.33. Or no, let's do 30, 32 first. <laughs> Sorry. Wherefore, because they sought it not by faith, but as it were by the works of the law, for they stumbled at that stumbling stone. As it is written, Behold, I lay in Zion a stumbling stone and rock of offense. And whosoever believeth on him, believeth on him, shall not be ashamed. Goes on, read the rest of that. Um, awesome, but I want to go over here um, to verse 9 and 10 and 11. For if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus, and shalt believe in thine heart that God hath raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. For with the heart man believeth unto righteousness, and with the mouth confession is made unto salvation. For the scripture saith, Whosoever believeth on him shall not be ashamed. Right there. Right there. You will be saved. All right, brethren, I am in part of a church. Uh, we are the Church of the Living God. Uh, church means called out ones. And I'm going to put in the description box what a church, according to the scriptures, looks like. And how there we are, what is the word? Um, you'll see. Watch the video. I'm putting it in the, in the description box. And he goes over how we are recovering from churchiality instead of being called out ones. Because you and I who believe, we are all, oops, there's our dove. Let's go see the dove. You and I who believe, here's the dove. I have doves that come to the window. We are, there shall, look at, there's two. <laughs> you and I, brethren, who believe, we are the church. We are called out ones. Many are called, few are chosen for certain works, but called means the church. Praise the Lord. Praise his holy name. Oh, there's more. There's more. These are all doves, guys. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Agape love.